this home, this family. No worry. They not hurt you. You friend Sito mean you friend family. Great. I always wanted to be best friends with a bunch of gorillas. Sito glad new friend like family. Shiny thing help new friend? Unless this shiny thing is about to sprout wings and lead me to the cloning facility, we're out of luck. New friend funny. Shiny thing not bird. Sound like name of snake from old zoo. Oh, maybe doctor under giant metal snake. The, uh, giant metal snake. Of course. New friend funny. How not see giant metal snake? It big. What word? Ride. I'm not going to let you kill any more of my friends. This is our home, not yours. If these feral ghouls are your friends, I'd love to see who you consider your enemy. How ironic you should say something like that. I'm thinking it's time we set our sights on the Commonwealth. Aiming pretty high, aren't you, Gage? Why stop there? Why not take over the moon while we're at it? <laughs> now nah, the little green men can keep that one. Commonwealth has a ton of shitty little settlements that could be put to better use. Don't you think? Wow, nuts. I was just starting to get cozy in my little castle. Now you're starting to sound like Coulter. You remember? The idiot whose body we recently dumped into the river? He's in charge of the caravan, so odds are you can find him somewhere near the marketplace. What's he gonna do? Show him how to milk a Brahmin? Maybe. If you ask him nicely. Well, anyone who stared at Nuka-Cola merchandise as long as I have would get this one pretty fast. The letters definitely spell refreshing. It's simpler than I was expecting. Well, damn. I was sure the letters spelled fresh ginger. That stuff is great in hot tea with honey, lemon, little brandy, a lot of brandy. Nice try, but you'd be one G short. So let's just assume it's refreshing. I'm such a fool for taking him on his word. He never told me that this would be the price. Huh. Smart enough to invent Nuka-Cola, but you still fell for that? Yes, make your jokes. But I've still accomplished ten times more in a single lifetime than anyone I've met, including you. I want you to shut off the power to this machine that's keeping me alive. I want to die. What? No! Come on. You're a disembodied head, trapped in a vault. You've got so much to live for. Despite your obvious sarcasm, you clearly recognize my situation for the living hell that it is. 